It was an accident. You're dead! <laughs> I thought he killed him, I was so happy. <laughs> For him being fucking scalped. About actually being scalped is hilarious. Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jimmy Merrick. It's time for episode five of season one of Mob Psycho 100. Last we saw, Teru? Is that his name? Yeah, because Tango was the other one. Uh, Teru found out that Mob is also an Esper. And I get the distinct feeling that the smack is about to be laid down. Let's get to it. Well, whatever. There are a bunch of questions I want to ask you, but first we need to establish something. How the hierarchy works around here. I'll lick my balls. The what? <laughs> Damn. Sorry, I wasn't listening. What? Why do you keep trying to attack me? I haven't done anything to you. Let's be friends. Using telekinesis, I teleport to my opponents and blow them away with my psycho fist. But this strategy I use against average people looks like nothing more than weird movements to him. <clears throat> Damn it. Shigeo, you need to teach this kid a lesson here. He is. One way or another, goddammit. That kid's putting his abilities to good use and living a fulfilling life. On the flip side, look at you. You live quietly one boring day after another. Do you really think there's anything appealing about you without your psychic powers? And you know what not to do with them, right? Point them at other people? Then you understand perfectly. Don't ever forget What's this, Daddy? And that's the moral code people like us with special powers need to live. <laughs> Crack to the madness! Brains, brawn, and even the law are powerless before a gift like mine! I'm special better than others, and the entire world revolves around He's me! He's over the top villain. Jeez. I understand you feeding your ego, but I can't have you breaking Shigeo either. He's not going to fight back, so obviously he's going to lose. And that won't work! Dimple. Ooh! Most of my is someone who can become a god. He's not some second-rate loser like you! Dimple, no! I erased that thing with my psycho wave from the core, so there shouldn't be a single shred of him left. Oh, shit! Work on your psychic powers instead! That Tsuboi sure got a nice ass, doesn't she? Who the hell are you calling a ladybug? How about I send you- Is it a memory you have of him? <laughs> Just for a sec, would you do me a solid and let me take over your body? Temple. What's wrong? Does it actually bother you that your little pet was erased? No, not really. <laughs> Compared to someone like me, you're third rate. Just a small frog. You can become big, Shigeo! I guarantee it! Some idiots get the wrong idea if Kill everything is spelled out for them. Well, they actually think they can well, be someone special if they... I'll make you submit to me with the power of my psychic abilities! So I hope you're ready! Nothing will stand in my way! That's dangerous. If it wasn't me, you could hurt someone. So stop. Are you trying <laughs> to tell me that you won't get hurt? Yes, I'll nigga. teach Yoda up! So, you're just gonna keep defending yourself? Look, I told you to stop doing that. I'll know how much you can take by administering an endurance test! Yeah. That hurt. Will you stop this? You caused an accident! <laughs> you see. It was an accident. You're dead! <laughs> I thought he killed him, I was so happy. <laughs> but him being fucking scalped. About actually being scalped is hilarious. I won't forgive you no matter what you say! <laughs> <laughs> he looks so ridiculous. Meet you, Taruki. No, it's not nice. It isn't as if we're friends now or anything. I just wanted to know the name of my enemy before I rip you to pieces. Yeah! So 
Stop stalling and face me! I'm popular and the main character of my story! This entire world and everything in it revolves around me! I am the chosen one! Me, Taruki Hanazawa! Let's have a test of strength! No way. Why not? I told you it's okay! Come at me! Because I don't want to hurt you, that's why. Huh? <laughs> Are you kidding? That's absurd! Hold on. That's it. I think I just realized why you hate me so much. It's because you and I are the same. And not because we both have psychic powers. But the fact that you have no confidence in yourself. Oh, shit. That I no standing out. Just another loser who won't leave a mark in this world. Don't you see? Deep down, you're the same as Classic. I am. That's hilarious. You just don't want we're the same. From my perspective, you're just an average person. Woo! <laughs> No, I won't. I can't use them against people. Is this it? <laughs> Started working out? That means no matter how hard you try, whatever that was, you called a punch is all you've got. It was very sad. Brother! <gasps> I'm going to change. Jesus. No. As a result of rejecting each other's ideals, there was no victor, and they were only left to fill the void in their hearts with a feeling of deep emptiness. Or so it seemed. Good! In the end, you couldn't stay true to your ideals either! Bring it! I'm ultimate barrier! Is he unconscious? What is all this? What the hell is this power? What? My powers are being sucked in by Kageyama! Oh shit! That's not incomparable. It's identity unknown. Alright, that's pretty good. <laughs> That's what I wanted. There we go, goddammit. He caused another accident because of his psychic powers. He didn't know where to direct his emotions. Aww. Sadness. Shit. You saw it, Kageyama. It's just as you said it was. Take away our psychic powers and we're nothing more than... Kageyama! Oh, hey guys. We were worried about you. You're not hurt, are you? No. no. It's kind of dope. It's he is kind of under construction. I get it. I'm with you. That was beautiful. The theory that this was man-made is gaining traction. That wasn't him. That wasn't my brother. He caught a cold. All right, that was episode five of season one of Mob Psycho 100. Where to begin? Hmm. I'm gonna start with Mob. Um, I appreciate what he's trying to do. I appreciate the fact that he doesn't want to use his powers on people. Which makes sense. It's dangerous. You can really hurt somebody. Um, but I've never wanted somebody to get their ass kicked more than I wanted Terry to get his ass kicked. And listen, at the end, it turns out he's just insecure. He lacks confidence. He just he displays in a different way than Mob does. He's a broken soul. I understand. Fuck all that. Toss this motherfucker into the atmosphere. <laughs> that was fantastic. Uh, Mob is scary. I don't quite understand how his powers work just yet. It appears that Mob has psychic abilities, right? But when he reaches a um, hundred, Mob's explosion, that it's not actually him, which is what his brother said at the end. That wasn't Mob. 
Well, he says the name, which I'm not gonna try to remember. Hard enough to get enough names down anyway. I got more names. Mob. And Teru said the same thing. Like, this is an entity or some shit. That is frightening. Um, is this like a uh, Alaka situation from Hunter Hunter? I don't know. I don't know. That was a really good episode. I know they only in it for half a second. I really love the fact that um, the uh, Body Improvement Club not only seem to be fans of Mob, but they're like a good guy. Like good guys. They were concerned about his well being. It was sweet. I like that episode. I like that a lot. Anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.